Good morning, people. This is Keith Modesto doing my Let's Play Minecraft series using Feed the Beast and Direwolf 20's mod pack. And um, I just wanted to show you real quick before we get started on uh, the wheat farm um, that my quarry is finished uh, mining that area I had set up in the northern desert. And uh, so can see all the wonderful stuff we've gotten. Now, this is the uh, the overflow chest, and I've been emptying it out, but when it got towards the end, I just let it build up here, especially the diamond, diamonds. I never took out any of the diamonds, so this is all the diamonds that I got from that quarry, 63. Now, there are a few extra here, because every once in a while I would go over there and um, and look at the, uh, you know, the bottom of the of the quarry to see any if any diamonds or other gems were showing and then use my sapphire pickaxe with fortune 2 on it to mine them so I would get extras and so when I did that with diamond I actually brought them all back and put them in here so I could see what you know how many total diamonds did I actually get from the quarry so if I hadn't done that this might be you know like 55 or 58 or something um, but anyway I think that's pretty good and uh, we'll just leave that there for now because what I want to do is uh, try to finish up setting up the wheat farm. Now I went. I went. Actually, what I, I think I said at the uh, at the last of the ep at the last at, at the end. Excuse me. At the end of the last episode, I would I would finish setting this up and then and then at the beginning of this episode. Um, kind of show what I came up with, but what instead what I did is I just went into uh, I opened up a, a copy of this or a, a copy of this seed that I have in uh, creative mode to uh, to just practice uh, to just play around with the the cargo manager and the distribution manager to see how I should you know do this because uh, because I find the cargo manager confusing and I think I might have figured it out. So we're going to try to do it now. Um, see, so yeah, I've placed all the stuff that I need in here. So let's grab. We'll start off by gra grabbing the cargo manager and the distribute and the cargo distributor and the cargo manager. Okay. So first, we're going to place the cargo distributor right there. Okay. Oh, I, I so I dug this little hole because most of most of the all the stuff that's going to be doing most of the work besides the cargo manager is going to be underground okay so let's tr 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 oh I, I disabled the solar engine here so that that thing would, would sit right there and not bother me okay so we've got this set down right next to the uh, advanced detector rail okay so that's good um, Excuse me, I think I will dig myself a little way down. Um, okay, we're gonna start off by trying to do something that's not too horrible by, um, by setting, uh, there's a couple, th there's like two things we need to pull out and two things we need to pull in, if I remember this right. So we're gonna start off by just by first handling cobblestone, and I might as well just put them all there. And I need a wind transport pipe, and I'll have to grab these. Okay, so one of the things we want to do is is we want a way to get. Hmm, I should have dug up to get um, bones. We want to get we want to get bones into the cart because that's a fertilizer to grow the wheat faster. And we're going to do that by setting down a uh, a uh, ender chest right here, and we're going to pull out the bones with a wooden conductive pipe or w a wooden transport pipe, excuse me, and then we just go up here. Uh, you know, actually, we need. To this is something we got to do. Whoops. And we're going to... Oh, well, it doesn't matter. You 
No, I should have placed this back further. Pipe there, 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 there. I don't, I don't want to put anything right here. I don't want to put anything right there because I might be putting a pipe up there, and then they'll connect. <coughs> they'll connect, and blah, they'll be bad. Okay, so there is a uh, Arctic gate, and we just need to set this to pulse when there's items in the inventory. Of course, I there isn't any, and I think, I don't think I grabbed any bones, did I? Alright, so, whoops. First thing we're going to do is, okay, so what we want to do is, um, this is the blue side. So the bones are going to come in the blue side, and we're going to put them, uh, actually, but first we need to set this so that it's all separated. And, let's see, the, uh, the cart is going to come along here and interact with this, with the cargo manager on the green side. So... We want, why did I lose my, I dislike that kind of thing. Okay, um, we want to set all of these to green. Whoops, there, okay. That's already green, good. And that's green, okay. So, um, so we just gotta pick a, a side. Of, we're, gonna, we're gonna have the bones go right here into the upper right. So we need to come down here and look at the blue and set this to upper right by dragging this icon that says top right to the blue square. There, blue square, top right. That means that anything that comes through this pipe and enters the cargo distributor through the blue side will be placed into the inventory on the top right. And so bones will go in here. Now we want these bones to go into the cart to the cart, and it's already set that way. The arrow says to the cart, so that's that is what we want. So that's done. Okay, cool. Now, um, and the next thing we want is to pull out wheat and seeds, and I need another. Okay, so and this is yellow. Okay, so now we want another ender chest, and this one is going to be. Okay, so this is orange. Wow. I thought I put it on the first square. Well, I guess that doesn't matter. Um, okay, so. So we need another wooden, um, a wooden pipe and some, actually, that's wrong. That's not where the wooden pipe's gonna go. The wooden pipe's gonna go right there. Excuse me, because I'm pulling out. Okay, so then we put our our cobble. This is the right kind of, isn't it? Oops, that's what we want. Yes, okay. And then we put an arct arctic gate right here, and we're gonna set this to space and inventory. Items in inventory, I mean, and then energy pulsar. All right, so, so this is being pulled out of the yellow side, and wheat, 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 where, um, okay, now, we're gonna have the wheat and the seeds, extra seeds, pulled out and placed into this cargo air as um, inventory area on the bottom right. So we need this to be set for internal uh, storage slots, and we want it to go from the cart to the manager, from the cart, excuse me, from the cart into the manager. Okay, and that was the. Let's see, so, and that's yellow. So we want yellow to be bottom right. Bottom right, yellow. All right, now those are the, and that's already set, right? Now those are the two easiest things to do. The next things we want to do after we sleep through the night is set up the water. Now, apparently, there's gonna be a new version of Steve's carts, uh, which will uh, have a liquid manager, which will make things simpler, but I don't have that installed yet.
since that, and since it's not that's not installed yet, we're going to uh, be using the uh, a liquid transposer. Okay, so first thing we want to do is make myself another room here. I just like lots of having lots of room. Okay, we're going to set down uh, a liquid transposer, which is whoops, up in the chest up here. Okay, um, let's get rid of that. Okay, so liquid transposer and um, waterproof pipe. Okay, so we're going to put the liquid transposer. the liquid transposer right there okay and we're gonna first thing we're gonna do is just get rid of all this stuff there we go all right uh, so we need to connect up to this um, pipe here and we'll have it Enter the back of this thing. So the back would be this is how this is all be the back. There. Right. Okay, so we should have water entering, yes. Okay, then we want to pull out um, we want to pull out the buckets from here. Uh-oh. No, we don't want to do that. Actually, you know what I think we'll do is we'll use, um, I think I have in here some stone, stone transfer pipe. Let's use that. There we go. What's well, still going to connect to that? I don't want that, but I can go up here. Okay. So we will have, uh, oh, I hope I have enough. Don't have enough, damn it. <sighs> okay. We're gonna move this. Oh, I'll leave that there. Okay, so uh, we're gonna put the liquid transposer right here. So, the um, where did my stone transport pipe? I don't know why it went there. Okay, so we'll put those right there and connect that right there. Okay, now this is going to be the full bucket. So I need this to be red, red. So that's the left red. I need this to be red. There we go. Um, and then we're going to turn the top off. All right. And then um, that actually needs to be blue. Blue. And this can be off. Um, actually, I, oh, that was the, yeah, that's the top. That's fine. And this can be off. Okay. So blue. That's where the empty buckets are going to go. Okay. So, and I don't think you need to have a wooden pipe there. So if, um, now, what did I say? Those are full buckets. So purple is full buckets, and I want the full buckets to go, I need this set to water buckets. I guess that was the longest way to go. There we go, water buckets. And I want the water buckets to go on the bottom right. Bottom right. So purple needs to be bottom right. Bottom left, I mean. Excuse me, purple, bottom left. All right, so I might as well do, uh, I guess red is gonna be top left. Red, top, left, red. 
All right. Then, okay, so I need to put buckets in there. Oh, and I need to, this needs, oh, I haven't set up the pipe yet. Okay, so we got a cobblestone, we need regular cobblestone pipe. We're gonna put that right there. Um, actually, I guess that does need a, that needs to be a wooden pipe right there. There we go. Um, cobblestone, this is gonna go here. It's gonna start raining. There we go. Okay, and then we need another arc duct to get right there. And we'll set this to items inventory pulsar. Okay. Oh, and this needs power. Da -da -da. Okay, and so the way we're gonna do this, let's get rid of these things, is we're gonna use oops, we're gonna use a solar panel. Where's my solar panel? Did I not grab a solar panel? Oh, here we go. Solar panel and um, an electric engine. All right. So, hmm, I guess we could make it go underneath. Right now it should, oops, lost my thing there. Okay, this should say no power. All right, yes. Well, might as well leave it open. Okay, so. Okay. So, we're gonna put, um, I guess we'll put the bat box right here. And we need a wrench. I hope this is the right kind of wrench. And go, there, we good. That is the right kind of wrench. And we need, actually, I need a different kind of cable here. Which I didn't bring. I think I didn't bring it unless it's in one of my bags, but I'll just go grab some. There we go. I probably don't need that many. Okay. Okay, so from the bat box to our liquid transposer. Now we need to get energy to the um, get energy to the bat box with that solar panel, and we'll connect it up here with this low voltage cable. There should be power going in there now. Yes, and is this getting power now? Uh, oh, what am I thinking? This is the wrong kind. Ah, of, uh, I don't want the bat box there. I want the I don't want the this needs to be build craft energy. Silly. Okay, so that's why I have the electrical engine after all. So the uh, electrical engine needs to go right there. There we go. And I guess we need a we need a put a we need to put a, a lever down. I have a lever somewhere. Okay, so this is the um, oh we still need this. Good. That is going to go from here to here. Okay, so this should be getting power. No fuel? Yes, okay, good. Um, so I need a lever. Let's see. Lever. Lever. One lever. All right. It's getting crowded here. Okay, lever. Um, right here. Okay, it's working. Cool. I'm going to turn this off so that bad box can build up some power. Okay. There we go. All right. Now we need some buckets. Okay. Now. Now I'll just put these in here. So... Buckets are going, full buckets are going on the bottom left, so we'll just put those right in there. Now, oh, and I gotta make sure these arrows are set up right. Um, to the cart, water to the cart, you know, I got this messed up. So, full carts, I mean, full buckets of water are gonna go to the cart, that should be right, and this should be where the empty buckets are coming from, or being taken out, so this needs to be from the cart. 
Am I thinking about? I'm not thinking about this right. We want these to go into the card, to the card, and this wants to be pulled from the card. Okay, I think that's right. Oh, okay, so we need to sleep through another night. And we're ready to try this out, I believe. Oh, I need to grab a, I need to grab a bunch of seeds. And put the seeds into... Well, I guess I have some seeds, but I can get more very quickly. I think there's actually a few seeds here, aren't there? No. Okay. Um, let's get rid of some things here. Okay. I'm going to grab that and open it up. There are some seeds in there already. I'm going to grab this. Oh, I have too much stuff in my... Let's get this thing here. And uh, put some of this stuff away. No, I don't need that. I don't need that. Alright, now we're going to harvest a bunch of this wheat. So I need to pull that out of here. Get rid of that, get rid of that. Okay. So now all I should have, no, the only thing I should have to do is to come over here, place the seeds in here. I have more seeds than I need. That's good. Okay. And, oh, I need some bones. Oh, excuse me, I need to do something. I'll be right back. All right. <coughs> now, what was that? Oh, I was going to get some bones. I have a few bones. Okay, so if I remember correct, this is where the bones are going to go. This will actually uh, test something out for me, I'm not sure about. Um, okay, so we need to go over here and turn this thing on by... Oops, that doesn't matter because there's no coal. This is the one we want. Okay, so now it should start moving. Uh-huh, yeah. What? Oh, wait, 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 wait. That is not right. What's it doing that for? <sighs> Something went wrong. Blue. Top right. So other things are connecting. Why isn't that connecting? Hmm. Cobblestone transport pipe. I did this before. Top right. I don't know why that didn't, I don't know why that wasn't going in. Let's see. Yeah, the wheat, there's wheat coming out, right? So that, that pipe worked fine. Water bucket went in. I don't know 
I saw it jumping it up, so. Oh, because it's already, it's already, yeah. Um, that makes no sense at all. Cobblestone pie. This should have worked. But I'm missing one now. Where did it go? There we go. It looks like it's connected now. Kind of weird glitch. I guess we're gonna see what happens. Blue, top, right. Mm. Maybe you have. To, maybe you have to set that before you put the pipe down. If you put the pipe down first, it, it doesn't actually connect. That could be why. All right, it's going in now. There we go. Huh. Well, I guess you have to do that in the right order or something. All right, so it's got more seeds. Because it has more seeds, it's now planting <clears throat> more uh, wheat. So it's going to take a little while to go around. So we've got we've got a water bucket in there, and now it hasn't emptied a bucket yet, has it? Oh, it would empty that bucket. So when it gets around to here, it should put place the empty bucket right here. That should get pulled out and sent to the transposer, so we can see that this is working. We're building up a little bit of a charge. So we need to turn this on. I might have to put another solar panel there if that can't. Actually, when this is all fully charged, then that should build up a charge. I don't know. We'll have to check on that and see how it does. Uh, wow, it went by without doing anything? Oh, I must have put the empty bucket in. Did it get pulled out? There's no empty bucket there. I didn't see it go by. Oh, I missed it. I don't know if it worked. Oh no, there we go. The so it did fill it up. I just missed it. So, so that's the. Um, oh, it got pulled out. I noticed that with the, my setup is sometimes you have you have extra buckets moving around. So that's gonna get. I wonder if it'll just drop. I guess we'll find out. That could be a problem. Maybe I should just have one bucket. That way, that won't happen anymore. <sighs> oh, there goes another bucket. This, this way of putting getting water to the cart doesn't really work very well. I have to say. I should change it to an emerald pipe until it only to pull out empty. That would make things that might work better. Actually, there's something else I should do first. Let's let's let that run down, run out of water, because I want. I actually don't want. Oh, I got some seeds. I need to set something else up here. We're gonna put down another. Ender chest. And we're going to put 
that one right here. Okay. And we're going to grab a pipe. Pipe, 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 pipe. We need a diamond pipe. Which bag is that in? Maybe this one. No. But I might as well grab more cobblestone pipes here. Uh, okay. This one? No. Oh, I know there's diamond pipes in here somewhere. Uh, okay, I guess I left them. Is it getting dark again? It is. I want to split up the seeds and the wheat, because they, they're going to eventually end up in different places, so I might as well send a different inner chest to begin with. There's my diamond pipe. I thought I put that in one of the bags. Place that with our diamond pipe right there, and then we want um, this to go right here. All right, and then we need to grab one piece of wheat and one piece of one seed. All right, and the black. Whoops. Okay, so the we want black to be wheat black is wheat and red to be seeds red seeds oops put those back grab these right here too okay and then hmm, we probably should have an overflow so we'll have more so right here, and this will go down into, do I have another chest handy? I have another chest somewhere. No. Oh, here we go. Okay, put that right there. Okay, so... And since we didn't put anything in green, anything that is not wheat or seeds, just in case somehow something else gets sent down that line, it'll go into that chest. Okay, now. Not yet. Well, this setup is pretty much done, except for I'm not really happy about the way that's working. So always getting it. Oh, I was thinking of getting an emerald pipe. Let's see if I have an emerald pipe on me. No. Okay, I have to go get an emerald pipe. I got some emeralds from villagers. Which is the only, well, and you can also mine emeralds. Emeralds occur naturally underground, I believe, but you have to be in the right kind of biome, and I'm not in uh, the right kind of biome, so. But you can get uh, emerald emeralds from, um, no, maybe I didn't make any emerald pipe, I think, but maybe I did too. So we'll just grab two here. Uh, three sapphires, here they are. Um, Anyway, I got some emeralds from uh, villagers just so I could make these pipes. There's probably other things you can make too. But... Okay, so. Uh, nothing is nothing is cooperating with me today. Okay, an emerald an emerald pipe is like a diamond pipe and a and a um, and a, uh, a a wooden transfer pipe combined. Come in. So, this is 
the one that we want to change. So we're going to put that right there, and then we're going to put our gate back on. And set this for items in inventory pulser. Now, oh, and I need to set it for an empty bucket, which means I need an empty bucket. Uh, I can get an empty bucket by just emptying this bucket. There we go. And we're gonna, oh, shoot. Okay, you can't, you can't set the emerald, you can't set the em emerald pipe while there's a gate in it, unfortunately. So we'll put that back. Now we'll click on it. We'll click on it and set the filter. Okay, to empty bucket. All right, now we gotta put the gate back. There we go. Okay, so items in inventory, energy pulser. And there is another emerald gate bouncing around here somewhere. I think. I think. Oh well, I guess it was. Oh, there it is. All right. Now, now we might have stray buckets in our, in our manager in weird places, but at least they won't be messing up the liquid transposer. All right, so let's see if we have space for water now. Yes, okay, so let's go ahead and try this out. By putting an empty bucket. Can we do that? I don't have an empty bucket because I, no, I guess I do. Let's put this empty bucket, right? It won't go in. Oh well. But, assuming this works right, an empty bucket should go in the top left, top left. So that should get pulled out. There we go, it already did. All right, so that's gonna get pulled out. It's gonna make its way down to the transposer. I'm gonna turn this off momentarily. Oops. Okay. Did it already go in? Oh, there it is, no. Okay, so this is making its way down. It's gonna end up in the, <sighs> in this slot right here. There we go, and now it's filling up the water. It already got pulled out, or pushed. I think it gets pushed. Yes, it's making its way up. And it should end up the bottom left, right there, to the cart. Let's see, I don't know if it'll make it before the cart leaves. Oh, it did. But, no, but it. But it already checked, so the cart isn't going to get its water yet. But the next time it comes around, it should pick that one up. And since since there's less than three buckets worth of water in there, it should use the bucket. It should use the water right away and put the bucket back. Okay, and it's going to put the... So there should be an empty bucket in here. Yeah. So it'll put the bucket back on this in this return trip. I'm just gonna let it do that and watch what happens. And we should we should have gotten wheat and seeds in here, huh? Is this set? Yes, it is. Okay. There we go. The empty bucket um, was pulled out, so it should be sent down, and everything everything should be working. So let's go ahead and reconnect this. Dun, 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 dun. Let's see here. I have to remember how to set this up. See, I, I changed the tracks a little bit so I'd have this little loop for testing, but now I want to reconnect. Uh, let me see, I, I have some rails here. I have some rails over here, I think. Yes. So what we're going to do is reconnect right here. Actually, what I think I will do is Disable that for a moment. Okay, so I want to take that out, take out that, put the dirt back down, and this should go right. Like, whoops! I guess I should have taken that out. There. Okay, so rail tracks right along here. Okay, now it's connected there, and then that gone. 
that gone, that gone, and I can't put track on the untilled ground, so I gotta take that out and put it back. Okay, so then that should connect up right there. That should be what we want. Yes, okay, so we'll just start this up again. Well, it's gonna go the other way. I don't know why that happens. Got plenty of water. All right, I think that this is working now. And now it's gonna start, actually I should give it more, well, actually the seeds are full, aren't they? I can't give it more seeds. Or no, I can give it more seeds. Let's make sure that's full. So, this should be working now. Uh, I'll just have to let it run for a while, see how it does. It might, uh, it might run out of water before it gets through the whole track, I don't know. Although it doesn't use very much water for, uh, you know, for each spot, so maybe it'll be okay. That's one of the things we gotta find out. And there's only one, bo one water bucket being used, so we shouldn't have any, there shouldn't be any problems with that, I hope. I'm gonna sleep through the night, but I guess I should just, I can wrap this, this is the wrapping up point. I've been rather incoherent, I think, in this episode. Ah, <sighs> well, I'll have to do better. Um, this has been Keith and Modesto. I finished, uh, I finished sending up the weed farm. Now it's all working wonderfully, I hope. Um, I'm gonna let it run for a while until so my next episode I can, I can, um, uh, Report if it's working the way I, I hope it's been work. It'll be working. The only thing that might be not working right is the the way the water is being transported into the cart. And when the new Steve's carts gets added to the mod pack, I could um, I could just switch that up, and hopefully everything will work better. Uh, okay, so uh, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a great day.